Welcome. Jeremy here with Voltage Coffee Project, and we're going to do today, what are we going to do? AeroPress, the easy way. First, I just want to show you uh, what comes in the AeroPress box. You got your AeroPress vessel with detachable filter screen, the plunger, coffee funnel, filters and filter holder, coffee scoop, and coffee stir paddle. Sweet, and then I've also got some fresh locally ground coffee here from West Oak Coffee. Today we are using a Colombian coffee from the Delagua farm. Uh, it's a natural pea berry, super delicious, super tasty. Uh, also, you're gonna need a mug, some hot water. I have here in a kettle, I have it a gooseneck kettle, but that's actually not even necessary. So if you've got any kind of electric kettle or you want to heat up some hot water in the microwave, go for it. So let's get started. First thing you want to do is you want to detach this little filter screen and then grab a filter, throw it in there, and then it just, you see it sits in there, and then it just lock it in like that. I like to rinse my filter a little bit before. It kind of helps to get some of that paper taste out of it. And uh, so you just like pour that in there, and let that drip out, and then dump that water out. You don't want to brew on top of that. That would be, uh, make your coffee watery and well, defeat the whole purpose of uh, putting it in there. So then we're gonna throw our uh, coffee funnel on top. We're gonna do a heaping scoop of ground coffee. Not like a super heaping, but kind of heaping. Toss that right in there. That funnel was very helpful. I thank you. I like to kind of even it out just a little bit. And got your hot water. I'm gonna throw some hot water in there. Just cover up the grounds. Make sure they're really nice and wet. And then I'm going to uh, stir that up just a little bit, making sure that there's no dry pockets in the coffee. Nothing fancy there. And then. Just pour real slow, slowly fill up your AeroPress. You can see no scale, no timer, just me and the coffee. That's all you need. That's how this was designed and that's why it makes a really awesome travel brew method. You could stir it up just to make sure that everything's uh, fully saturated. Um, again. It's probably not 100% necessary, but uh, you know, why not? You place the plunger on top. And, ooh, hello. And just kind of lean on it a little bit. I find about the weight of my arms is sufficient. You see I'm plunging it nice and slow as well. And during this time, the coffee, the sweet, sweet coffee is brewing. I'm just chilling. Cool thing about the AeroPress is that once you're finished, you just pop that bad boy off and boom, there's your coffee ground. So it's super easy to clean. And uh, you rinse that off. I'll rinse that off real quick. Rinse that off. Pretty much ready for your next coffee. Awesome. Man, that's delicious. So good. Sometimes it's nice to not have to work so hard for it. You know what I mean? Sometimes you just want to wake up, dump some coffee in your AeroPress, plunge it, and drink it. Don't worry about times, and pulses, and... Heck, get your coffee pre-ground. Ask your barista to grind your coffee when you buy a bag. Anyways, that's it. Enjoy your coffee.